Bucky's, where the beaver never sleeps. Best slogan ever. Kind of a missed opportunity, Hooters. We've been getting requests to go to Bucky's for years now, and who would have thunk it? This place is right in our back door. Daytona, Florida. This place has it all. It's even got an area for us to take our dog to excrete their waste. My goodness. This is a premium gas station, Julia. If your dog did his duty, please do yours. And by that, that means you need to have a broom and a dustpan. We just made it! Oh my god, I'm so excited to get in there. This isn't even the entrance, this, this is the side entrance, and they decorated it like with a hug. Air hug. Let's go in there. All right, this is what everyone online requests we go here, this is it. I feel like I walked into not a gas station. This is a store. Are these dog treats? Which one do you want? Get it the broken one, see if we get a discount. This is where it's at, folks. They got everything here. Cold light pimento cheese. Baked potato salad. Mustard potato salad. Bucky sizzling saltines. Bean dip. Edible cookie dough bites. Smoked turkey tenderloin. Pecan pie. And world famous jerky. An entire wall dedicated to it. This is like all the stuff you want to eat when you're on the road. Bucky's craft hot sauces. And seasoning. And coffee. And sauce. I wouldn't be surprised if they make their own Coca-Cola. They have their own cup. Popcorn. Pork rinds. Snack rings. White cheddar habanero. White Cheddar and nothing ain't complete without the hot foods. Apple pie, sausage on a stick, sliced turkey sandwich, cool pork sandwich, and this thing's got weight to it. Oh my god, perfectly portioned now. Ooh, look at all that sauce he's dripping on. He's like ladling sauce from the meat station over. You should go around and just grab one of one of each and every one of these hot sandwiches. They got cinnamon glazed pecans, cinnamon glazed cashews, cinnamon glazed almonds. You wanna try them? You gotta have a snack while you're shopping. Mm. Beaver nuggets, chocolate rocks, unicorn popcorn, really. There's more. Rice crispy treats. Brownies. Batteries. That's the Bucky guy, right? Little Debbie. It doesn't end. What don't they do? Candy blocks, candy corn, wax bottles, saltwater taffy, roasted salted pepitas, raisins, corn nuggets, wasabi peas, strawberry meringue, cappuccino meringue, Carolina Reaper, peach chipotle, avocado tomatilla. Did you see the gummies? I do want this though. Dude, those are the best. Are you kidding me? Especially the Mountain Dew ones. And it's empty. They're gonna like tease me with all this stuff, but the only thing that I want they don't have the icy. Yeah, well, maybe the one in St. Augustine has it. For Bucky's sake, let's hope so. Look at all the desserts. Jalapeno cheddar, sausage biscuit, sausage cheese kolache, sausage cheese jalapeno kolache, sausage pepper jack kolache, boudin kolache, blueberry muffin, banana pecan muffin, orange cranberry walnut muffin, peach muffin, blueberry scone pecan pie, kolache, banana nut and bread. Oh my gosh. And they got fudge, everybody. Hey, look, guys, you can get your own Bucky's soda. They got popsicles. They got pecan logs. Julia, they got their own Altoids. Oh my god. They got little tiny little packets of nuts. Dude, they're just throwing Bucky's products down your throat. This is crazy. This place has it all. I'm so exhausted I woke up an appetite. All right, let's do it. And round one. First time going into Bucky's, and now I have my first bag of food from there. Beaver nuggets. It's sweet, it's like creme brulee. This would be great with milk. Beaver nugget cereal, folks. It's just like corn pops, but a bit more sweet. I can't eat this with her doing that, which is why we bought her a nice happy treat. Sit. Yes. Good girl, take yes, it. Yes, baby. Just, you gonna eat the whole thing with that? I got the pulled pork barbecue one first. $5.99. Pretty expensive. I'm not normally the person that buys pulled pork, but it looks pretty darn good, right? Is that a brioche? Is it a brioche? I think it is. I like it. Time on time. This reminds me of Bill Gray's. Chicken sandwich, $4.99. Comes with pickles and a sauce. Maybe slightly spicy? Mm. I mean, it's good. Boo. I think I'd rather go to Popeyes, but hey, if you're craving it, they have the flavor that serves. Chicken sandwich, one out of ten. The review continues. Here we have a sliced brisket coming in at $5.99. They put the barbecue sauce on there, but I also got some extra on the side. Mm. Wow. It's like a mouthful, I can't talk. I like it. Yeah, I do. It's really good flavored. I like the barbecue sauce. It's super tender, kind of just pulls right apart as it should. Brisket. Nine out of ten. Five ninety nine for the chopped brisket. When she is being such a creep in the back right now. <laughs> oh yeah. Feels like more meat in there. Mm. Good, man. Good. You said good burnt. Good Ever. bite. Good big bite. Yeah. Chopped and sliced. Nine out of ten. Equally great. I would go for the chop because there's more sauce. But sometimes you just want a slab of meat in your mouth. Five ninety nine for the barbecue turkey sandwich. Also sliced meat. 
That's some real good turkey. And you know what? The addition of that sauce was so ideal. I'm not gonna lie. Ooh, Bucky. I never thought I'd think a beaver would be so cute. Wow, that's surprisingly delicious. That's a big piece of turkey. You're getting a good old seven out of 10. Surprisingly delicious on such a thick scale. All right, this is the last thing in tin foil. Bucky's Club Melts, $5.99. This actually looks like a better version of a Wendy. Mm. Good. It's ham and turkey, cheese, bacon, and some yummy sauce. It's kind of spicy. It's got a lot of flavors that are making my mouth say I want more. You are also a 10 out of 10. I would get you and a pulled pork anytime. What the heck is happening? Here we have a sausage on a stick coming in at $5.99. It has the tortilla in here. Wow, Munchie really wants this. Look at this. Oh my god, it looks like a dog treat. It's actually a really good idea to wrap a tortilla around that. Really good. It's the first time I've ever eaten a sausage with a tortilla around it, so it's blowing my mind. It's actually good. Very inventive. I give you an eight out of 10 on creativity, six out of 10 on flavor. With that being said, we have to just try these two more things. Actually, I got this just because I wanted to have it. Like, I wanted to put this in like a little bowl, you know, with like some plants, and people would be like, yo, are those rocks? And I grab it, and I just eat it, and they're like, whoa, how'd you do that? 